the search for Maritime continues. Let's go. I didn't want to think of an outside in where I this. From the clock tower. I ran towards an anxiety swelling inside of me. That was no other ordinary scream. When I arrived, the cry left from my own throat. Yeah. I knew it. I knew it. And you look so creepy right now. Legit. This could make a horror. The <laughs> horror thumbnail. Jesus. What's up, desperation? I heard footsteps approaching from behind me, and a moment later, I was being pulled by the arm. Bolted for the clock tower. The ground had turned spongy, and now progress was madly slow. It felt like running on the trampoline. Rise placed her hand on the entrance, on the entrance to the clock tower. I was seized in the grip of fear. I felt certain that any minute I was going to hear a thumb or a splash sound behind me. door opened with a heavy sound. Assaulted by a terrible sense of bombarding, I shut my eyes tight. And this incident had to happen in chapter 13. Foreboding aged as we enter the tower. So this is what it's like in here. Faint light streaming through the windows, making it look like the set of a shadow play. The windows were large enough that I could make up the shape of the room. It was empty, with a staircase running along the wall. Spread a prayer as we ran down the race against her. Our footsteps pounded heavily on the iron stairs. <sighs> There's no really where Marikasan is, is there? <sighs> if she fell from that night, she would put it so funny. Why isn't there a rail railing? I groaned in frustration. <laughs> That was also the reason there was no guardian stationed right by the school gate. It was strange how one Zen could be so strict in some ways and so lenient in others. The fact that I was here was another example. Here I was under her false arrest. And though they kept a close watch on my door, my veranda went unwatched. On one hand, it was, it was good that they trusted the students, on the other hand, they really underestimated them sometimes. Bad luck, and this is chapter 13. So, so you could do it. What? What? 
が悩んで苦しんでいたのはそばにいた私が一番よく知っているの私がそれは間違いですって言わなければならなかったのになのに私のしたことと来たらただダクダクと従うばかりで辛さを分かち合おうともせず引き止めることもせず本当何が親衛隊長よ切れてしまうミツキさんいずれにしろまだ泣くのは早いわマリカ様にはきっと支えが必要なものその時あなたがそんな弱気では困ってしまうわ<笑>そうねミツキさん briefly wiped her tears away and h i d e n her expression 今度こそシェフドコールの一命に恥じない働きをしてみせるわ。Can do that, but let me do the saving, okay? Let myself do the saving. Because it really is not safe for you to win in a situation like this. We don't want you both to fall down, okay? You must have should be strong enough to hold her back. この一命だって自分にとって決して嫌なものではなかったのだから。We were all out of breath by the time we reached the summit. じゃあ、開けるわよ。r i s e s a n opened the door. The heavy padlock that fastened it had been removed. And that is very loud. When we saw Marika beyond, I breathed an initial sigh of relief. But she was still standing right on the ledge, looking out over a long drop. I wasn't acrophobic, but realizing how far the drop would be, I felt overtaken by fear. Itsuki san, you have to calm down. I clasped her hands firmly. Just the slightest shift in the balance would cause her to fall. We should speak to her very calmly. So, <laughs> Itsuki san took then a deep breath and called out to her again. But Marika wouldn't turn around. I tried to grab her. I probably just end up pushing her off the edge. So I remained where I was. To win. It was raining very hard, soaking my already sweat drenched body even further. Time seemed to pass very slowly. It felt like hours before Marika's son spoke. Though, in reality, it had likely only been a few seconds. Mitsuki. Atakushi. Atakushi. Akaranaku na te shimatta. The rain was still falling hard, but the noise wasn't intrusive. Perhaps because there was so little nearby for it to shrink. So, even amidst the falling sheets of rain, Marika's son's softly spoken words didn't reach us. それを知っているつもりでしただから何を疑うこともなく振る舞ってラトゥトゥスールの立場となっても私は何も迷うこともなく正しいことを実践している
そう信じて疑うことはありませんでしたなのに今回私がしたことはどうしても正しいこととは思えずそうなると私がこれまで正しいことと信じてやってきたことも全ては実際のところそんなことはなかったのかもしれないとそう思ってしまってもう何もかもわからなくなってしまってつまるところ私は私自身がわからなくなってしまったんですお姉さまは常に正しかったですそれはそばにいた私が一番知っているつもりですでもお姉さまごめんなさいえ神ではない人は必ず間違いを犯します大事なことは謝りを謝りと認めて正していくことだと思います時には自分を見失うことだってあるはずですそんな時こそ周りが手を差し伸べなければならないのに私はただ見ているだけでした苦悩に気がついていたのに私は何もすることができずこれではシェフドコールの一命が泣きますねそんなことお姉さま聞いてください私もさっき自分の謝りに気がついたんですどういうことリセさんのことです私は謝った気持ちから彼女を遠ざけ自分からも離れていったのだということを知りました謝りをして正して私はとても晴れやかな気持ちになりましたそうだからお願いですお姉さまもええ、あなたの言うことはきっと正しいんでしょうね、ゆつき。ああ。ああ。ただね。マリカ様の正しさを保証していたのは神ではないはずです<笑>顔言っては失礼ですが私はずっと不思議だったんですマリカ様の確信は一体どこから来るのだろうって結果的に正しいか正しくないかはこの際二の次だと思います問題なのは迷わないことなぜって私たちは迷うことの方がむしろ自然のはずだからです迷うことの方がむしろ自然ええなぜでしょうだってそういう年頃ですものそうではありませんかマリカ様リシさん、spoke with a smile in her voice. Gradually, the smile began 
you been through America so this expression to you? そうでしたね。理性の優等美です。私はそんな自明のことも忘れてしまっていました。いつから私は正しくあることを自らの祈りとしてきました。そして私をずっと導いてきてくれたのが祖母だったのです。確信はそういうことだったのですね。おばあさまの指示で。はい。ミシさんブリーフ、ペイン、ペイン、ニューウォール。ああ。ネッツライト。マイケス、グランマ、モーセ、ヴァンセン、エプライザー、サンティング。ずっと信じてきたのに。道し
even my greatest effort was efforts with friendly. I swam through the air. I stretched out my right arm as far as I could. By then, my guess I was already falling. <laughs> I had managed to grab onto it just barely, but the crisis wasn't over yet. I can't stop. Thanks to the momentum of the fall and the wet floor, my body was continuing to slide. I slid out to my hips and the distant ground the located to view. I closed my eyes tightly, and there was nothing to grab onto. There was no way to get back onto them. And yet... Despite half of my body ruining over the ledge, I stopped. <laughs> Girls were grabbing onto my legs. Hey, you, do you think you can pull me back up? I managed to ring out the words, but it sounded like they were at the limits already. <laughs> Shit. What could we do? There was no way anyone was going to find us here on the crop tower on a rainy night. Work. Our voices would have traveled 10 meters in this heavy rain. You've still got a lot of learning to do about righteousness, right? I don't want to die. But you don't want to die either, right? Isn't that right, Barakasama? I want to hear what you have to say, Marigasa. Who cares what God, your grandma, or anyone else is saying? What's important? What you have to say. Right? Isn't that right? I raised my voice, giving her a hand, a squeeze. Trying to communicate my wish with her. She could understand me. Listen to me! Marika san! That's all I need to power me through. <laughs> Despite the situation we were in, we exchanged a smile. Hey, can you get that phone working? <laughs> My body moved forward 5 centimeters then stopped. I always had a hard time. An alternative could be could you use your whole body weight to link to to your whole? You know? Marika-san had one hand free. All we could do was pray that she didn't drop it. <laughs> Just then, Marika received a incoming call, and it caused her hand to tremble. What I had here became reality. Cell phone, our lifeline dropped. It stopped in the air. Strap caught on her pinky finger. 
Marcuson's eyes are not. Think that you should tell me. お前は一体何を言っているんだ。小林様に宣言しておきたいことがあります。え。こんな方のか。私は。Yeah, well said. Shut up! Beep! 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 Call cut off. This time, Mike manipulated the buttons skillfully and called back to school for help. So, we were saved, just in the nick of time. Just in the nick of time. Electra was waiting for us afterwards, but Marika-san's presence there meant that we weren't interrogated too closely. これが呼び出しの常連だけならわかりますが。ミツキや。ましてや生徒会長のマリカまでいます。これは一体どういうことなのでしょう。申し訳ありません。すみません。あ。あなた方は謝罪なしですか。Two of us bowed hastily, so we say he's going to put a knife for dissatisfaction, and then he's just let out the sun. まあいいでしょう。マリカもいる以上、今回のことは単なる遊びではなかったのでしょう。下がって構いません。それから、すぐにお風呂に入りなさい。Oh, that's right. If we had been some too, then Mistress is often still soaking wet. Not even the presence of Marika's and Mitsuki's son had soft hair enough to let us change first. Oh, right. I couldn't believe that Pet Mistress was being nice, but... Well, I have to go tomorrow anyway. <laughs> I blinked a few times, then nodded in confusion. Maybe she really is a nice person, huh? I feel kind of bad for getting the wrong idea about her. Hmm.That went that. That goes the theory. Reese's 
だから実質的と言っているのです How are you so sure? Bitch! What do you see tomorrow? 果たしてそうでしょうかえお二人は決定していると思いますそう、わかりませんねえなんだか変だったわね。熱が出たのでなければいいけれど。The rain passed quickly, and by the time we got back to the dawn, the moon was bright and the night was. She turned to us in the entryway and bowed low to us. No, no, no. Who needs you to apologize? We don't need you to apologize. Who needs you to apologize? Your grandmama. Alright? Your grandmama. She doesn't apologize then. There is no point. Huh? It's completely not your fault, okay? Not in the slightest. I got to see your cleavage, so it's all good. <laughs> Okay, yeah. I accept that. Got a apology. Oh, mm. well, you've got some thinking to do, I guess. Mm -hmm. If Amerika-san had fallen into depression, she had always had a confident smile on her face. Seeing her cow like this is definitely strange. But hey, no point dwelling on the past. Let's just be glad it's over. Those things. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> I think I just got excited and it was pretty rough thing to say. Oh god, I perhaps I am then. Like, mess with this. <laughs> Are you enjoying this? <laughs> well then, I really. My voice trailed off weakly as I saw America sound approach me. Hello! The face was very close to mine. The cheeks were brightly flushed, maybe because of the rain, but it has stopped. Right. What, what is it? She pressed her face in close to mine while I didn't necessarily find the proximity I pulled back reflexively. New love candidate. Is that a sign of a new left candidate? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! That's it, I'm playing every round. Okay? I'm playing every round. <laughs> In my spare time, but I'm going with Chiyos for this. And perhaps record. Record Marika's movie? Or Ayaka's? 
I definitely will play every single route in my spare time. Where gets them pulled away from me quickly, leaving only a sweet fragrance behind. What in the world just happened there? Let's do that. Uh, right. <laughs> Whoa. Left candidate number two. Get <laughs> Oh no. So reset. Ayaka. Reads go. Ruriko, Konomi, Marika, Mitsuki, Seven, Seven Love Candidate, and Chiho, Eight. Is that really true? Is there really eight ghosts? Eight routes? It can be, right? It can be, right? Well, if I knew you were possible love candidate, I would definitely, definitely consider you to be my, to be my first playthrough. <laughs> I might have earlier on, but I had already decided, decided eh? it's gonna be Chiho first. Urgh. Premier judgment. A week. In a week. Apparently not even to me I had caught word of what happened last night. The atmosphere around school went unchanged. Which meant It's finally time to say goodbye to Messiah. Sorry. Yeah, it is. It almost feels a bit sad though. Is it true, Bennett? Yes, that's true, Bennett. <laughs> Reese's son is acting the same as ever. I thought she might decide to see him go. Maybe she's sick of him, though. Yeah, you may be right. The whispering voice is all cut off at once. Marika's voice came out from over the speakers. <laughs> The entire class fell into silence. It seemed to be the same everywhere. No sounds came from outside the classroom either. <laughs> the headmistress. She's gonna be so mad. <laughs> oh wait, that's not how a uh, click. Oh, that's a clicking gun. clicking sound. And make it. <laughs> As the announcement ended, the voices came back in the hat, rising up. I don't think she's gonna tell us all the old things he did to her. There's no way. Girls are all wrong. Oui. 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 Oui.
あるただ他の人には黙っていて真相はマルタ様の口から明かされるべきだと思うから、うん、そう思ってアナウンスしたわけですもんねわかりましたボートまでまだ時間がある。だが、何かがどうしてもというのでな。なるほど、I was going allowed to leave my room on Marcus' say so. なりましょう。He walked down the hallway. Marika said that the head of the forest got in came with us. Marika, I'm not sure what you're doing. I'm not sure what you're doing. And Marika sent some flinching response. The guardian fell into silence. Um, where, 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 where are we going? Well, I guess I'll find out soon enough. It appeared we were hidden for the cathedral. Marika-san turned to us just before the entrance. By everyone, you mean? <laughs> okay. And this is where I should stop. Aha! She was right. The enormous cathedral was full to bursting. It looked like the entire student body had come. And. <clears throat> the fate of Messiah shall be revealed next episode. Next part. However, you like to call it. Call it. So, I'll see you then. Tomorrow, perhaps? If it's not a weekend, then. If it's a weekend tomorrow, then Monday. But otherwise, tomorrow. Yeah. See ya.